Hi, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can fix the iPhone XS stuck in an Apple boot loop. Now, there are a few things that can cause your phone to get stuck in a boot loop like this. So, you just go to the Apple screen and then it's just we keep restarting and restarting. So, one of the things that can cause this uh, happening is the battery. If your battery is damaged or if it's getting too old, that can cause your phone to just keep rebooting so just go to the apple screen and then just boot again so one that's one of the things is the battery another thing is after you have replaced the screen sometimes it can cause the issues as well for example when you replace the screen the screen cables not connected properly or some other issues that can cause the phone to keep restarting now if you recently got your device and you know that it's still in very good conditions or if you have recently uh, flashed a new software uh, on your uh, phone or if you have a performed update then that can also cause your phone to keep rebooting so that is kind of like a software issues so if that is the case then you can try to press on the power button in the volume up key so press and hold so continue to hold until your phone uh, switch off So just press and hold. So the side button and the volume up button. Now you can see the phone now will switch off. Once it switch off, just uh, wait for around 30 seconds. And after around 30 seconds, you can try to switch back on. You can also try to press on the side button and the volume down keys. Press and hold. Again, press and hold until your phone uh, switch off So give that a try and if um, By uh, Trying to turn off your phone and turn it back on it Doesn't work What we can do next is try to um, Have your phone into recovery mode now. This is really the last option because um Resetting your phone will cause you to lose all data. So only try this if you are prepared to lose all your data on your phone. And if you are, then we can now uh, try to um, uh, reset the device or restore the, the phone with a new uh, software download to your device. Okay, now what, that what we need to do is first we're going to open up iTunes on your computer. So here, open up iTunes. Then we're going to plug in the cable to the phone and to the computer. And next we need to put the phone into recovery mode. So press on the volume up key, then volume down key, and press and hold to your side button or the power button. So we're trying to boot into recovery mode. So if it doesn't work the first time, you can try again. So press on the volume up, volume down, and then quickly press and hold onto your side button until the phone will boot into recovery mode. So we're just going to wait. You can see the phone still um, trying to boot. So next we can try to press on to your side button and volume down key. So this will force the phone to uh, switch off. So you just have to be patient while doing this because it's not going to always work the first time. So I'm just going to press on volume up, volume down, and then press into the side button. Also, another thing that you might want to check if it doesn't work correctly is the cables. Uh, sometimes a bad cable can cause um, the phone not to boot into recovery mode. So make sure that you have a working uh, cable and uh, we can try it again so i'm just going to press and volume up volume down and press onto the side button and hold and wait so we might have to wait uh, for a while so while even if it's uh, booting up just uh, try to be patient and wait 
and now we are in recovery mode now as you can see you want to click on the restore button now because I have already downloaded the firmware so I'm just going to press on the shift key and click on restore but if you haven't downloaded before you can simply just click on the restore button so I'm going to click on restore and update and here I say uh, clicking on next uh, we're going to install um, 13.7 then click on agree and here you can see we try to download so if you haven't uh, downloaded before it will try to download so we can you can wait for the download to finish now earlier I have downloaded a file it's um, version 13.6.1 but obviously now it is 13.7 so I might as well just wait for iTunes to download uh, the latest one so I can uh, have the latest 13.7 uh, now once the download is finished it will try to um, update your phone and hopefully that will fix the boot loop problem so we're just going to wait for it to finish okay once the download is finished you can try to um, put your phone into recovery mode again if it's got out of recovery and then click on the restore button and then click on restore and update and now it is extracting software so it's uh, extracting software at the top right there extracting software and again the phone is still in recovery mode okay now it is preparing for restore so here is the apple logo waiting for iphone so now it is restoring okay so now it is restoring wait for this the restore to finish okay it's halfway uh, through the restore and in iTunes say like iPhone so it is looking good so we just keep waiting okay now finally I come to the activation lock screen so I just need to print my Apple ID and password and I can unlock it and that's it so now it's come to the hello screen and I can set up my phone again Unfortunately, doing this method will cause uh, you to lose data. But at least now it is uh, working again. So you can see um, we can now uh, set up the iPhone and fix the Apple uh, boot, loop pro uh, boot loop problem on the iPhone XS. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.